Hi, in today's tutorial we'll be showing you how to connect automatically or how to allow an automatic connection to take place uh, to, uh, to this VPN server through the OpenVPN uh, client. Now, in a previous video we showed you how to download and install the OpenVPN client, how to set it up and how to connect to the server. However, it asked us to, uh, to enter our credentials each and every time. Now, there is a small trick that we can do to avoid uh, being asked for these credentials. Now, let's try first by uh, revising or going through the normal way to reconnect or to connect. Now, here we just go down to the OpenVPN task uh, icon in the taskbar. We right-click on it and we click on Connect. And then it asks us for our credentials. We enter our credentials, we click on OK, and we just connect right away. Now, how can we connect? Do we have to enter our credentials each and every time? No, we don't. There is a way to have it connect without asking for it. Now, this way is pretty simple. We're just going to close it here. You're going to go to the search icon, click on it, and search for Notepad. Okay, and you're going to open the notepad. Now, in the first line here, you're going to enter your username or uh, the, the username that you use or your email address that you use to log on to your um, VPN service. And, in the, and you press enter. And the second line, you enter your password as appearing here. Now, I'm going to do that right now. So, I enter my email. And then enter and enter my password. And I save this file, so save as. And then on my desktop here, I'm going to save it as, just go back, and save it as login, login.txt or login.txt. And click on save. And I'm going to close it. And then I'm going to open the OpenVPN file or OpenVPN folder. Okay, we go down to the OpenVPN and we open the configuration. Okay, now just leave that open for a second. And you're going to take this file here, the one that we just created, and move it to the folder, the configuration folder of OpenVPN. Now, we're going to open the file, the text file of the server itself, or the configuration file of the server itself that we downloaded last time from uh, the VPN uh, website, or the VPN provider's website. We're going to open that file, and then we're going to scroll down to the line that says authorization user pass, Okay, and leave just a space and type in the name of the file that you just created with the credentials. And then you go to File, Save, and you close it. Now let's give it another try to connect. Here we go to the OpenVPN icon, right click, and connect. And just leave it to take its steps. And see, it didn't ask us this time for the credentials, and you're connected. There it is. There is the notification that you are connected. You just close that, and that's it. You're done. Thank you for watching.